research, and if we get back to permitting and encouraging people to organize and bargain to happened in the 40s, the 50s, and the 60s happened well, about the 20s and the 30s. We will that tie that lifts all those boats, and people will feel that once again America is working for all of us. And that is why yeah, America needs to work for all of us. America doesn't need to work for the working. America needs to work for the working and the non-working. People who are lazy. America and needs to work for them too. To return to fiscal responsibility and protect fiscal the Fiscal responsibility. And social security so they're always there. What President Bush has done is to have two overwhelming goals. Yes. Really. I can't find any other goals but these two. Okay. Number one, tax cuts for the wealthy. Well, when you say and tax cuts for the wealthy, it's a fair tax cut, which means we'll pay the same percentage of tax cuts well, so that it is fair. President. We will he not punish anymore. people who make money simply by president. saying, you make money, we the government have decided you can earn this certain amount, you can live on this certain amount, you don't need any more money. Money is a because we, the government, have decided so. Instead, the American government will say, We want all of you to be wealthy, all of you will get tax cuts across the board. Rich, poor, middle class, everyone will have a tax cut. We will not have divisive politics like the Democrats who will claim that because you make more money, you should pay more taxes when you are already paying more taxes because you make more money. Well, your fellow Americans were left. We will not punish the wealthy. We will not punish the industrialists. We will not punish the economically savvy American. Paying no attention. For the poor. We will not take from Peter to give to Paul. Those who want that are usually Pauls. It is morally wrong to take from one human being and give to the other simply because he has none. Just because he has none doesn't give him a right to take from someone else who has worked for it. Wealth is not evil. Wealth is good. We want all people as Republicans to be wealthy. We do not want tax increases. We are never for tax increases of any kind. The Democrats can consistently tell you that we want tax cuts for the rich. We want tax cuts for everyone. We have never seen a Democrat who is in favor of tax cuts for anything. They claim they are just for not tax cuts for the rich. They really mean is they want tax cuts for all. They want more government programs which will take more of your money. And they will use children as barricades for their programs. As if you yourself can bring up your children. As, it is, as if somehow it is the United States' fault that children are abandoned. And that children are left in the wilderness. As, it is, as if it is not the government programs that has put them there in the fucking first place. She didn't run into any woman with her two sons. She's There is no son. She is full of shit. She said, I just tell you what it's like not knowing from day to day. She never said that because she doesn't exist. I want to be able to say to you as your president. Not all politicians lie. The Democrats we are is the future that we for every single the future that we want no is less government and for the United States and the American people to be able to lift themselves up out of the gutter if they are in the gutter without government intervention telling them how much they can and how much they cannot make through minimum wage what if I am worth more than 725 an hour sir you only have to pay me 725 don't you I'm worth more than that. Fuck you and your fucking minimum wage. Go fuck yourself. I have more faith in the American people than the Democrat machine ever has and ever will. More words like change. Oh, she said the word change. Let's all fawn over her. She said change. Although she hasn't mentioned one thing she will do in order to change, but she said the word change. 
system in Arkansas and bring health care to rural areas. She won't the bring change to health care healthcare and education. Healthcare, She's in league with the teachers' the fucking union. Program. She will never be and for the teachers being responsible for the teachers and the students that they teach. She will never ever be for teachers being fired who do not fucking perform. She is in league with the teachers union, as you may well or may well not know. Because I know what we're in danger of. I'm from America in the middle of the country. Are you? You communist? I was born in the middle of the last century, which seems like a really long time ago now. My father was a World War II veteran who came home from service and began to start his own small business. Uh, it's amazing. You've been working against any war ever since. You've been working against the Vietnam no, War, the Gulf War, and now this Cold War. Saved up the money to buy a car. Uh, the fact that he's a World War II veteran. My mother 